Hey guys, good morning. So today I am going to be doing, well, I'm doing a weekend in the life of an entrepreneur. I don't normally work for those who are just like joining my journey. Um, I set boundaries for myself with my business because last year and I was very burnt out. I did love and inspiration 24 seven. And although I love, love, love what I do, that's not what I wanted to do because I wasn't making time for myself. I wasn't making time for my, you know, it was just, don't want to do that. So I put myself on a schedule and I don't normally work. Uh, I'm off every other Friday and I don't work at all on the weekends. But because I have a lot to do today or a lot to get done by the 28th or Monday that I want to launch, which is my Ego Masterclass, I am going to make an exception because we all have to do that in the real world sometimes. You may have a conference that you have to speak at that's on the weekend, so it's no different than that. So it's okay because it's my first one this year and I don't plan to have many of those. So I'm going to... Um, just take you along the journey of what it looks like to work with me uh, in the weekend, what I'm doing, what I have going on. I'm literally just chilling, nothing special about me. Just pop some earrings in just to make myself feel a little bit better. And uh, I got some little short shorts on, some fuzzies. Wow, the fact that I was able to do that. Mm. I ain't gonna try it again because I don't want to, you know, do anything stupid. Bust a, bust a, uh, spring, pull something or something. But, um, I just got shocked that I was able to do that. Um, so I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting old. I'm not old, but I'm getting old. So I'll be 33 in July and the body just definitely does not move like it did when I was 17. So, yeah. So I'm just chilling. Um. I'm gonna start getting ready and wearing the greatest of all love. It's not available on the website because I don't know. Um, I launched something else instead of this design, but I just I, I still wear it because it's still part of the the collection. And so, um, yeah, hair is still curly, which is good. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get started. All right, guys. So I am out in the living room right now, and I am going to. I'm sitting in my spot. This has been my favorite spot with my, uh, yeah. So I'm going to turn on some old episodes of Grey's Anatomy like and watch it like I've never watched it before. Then I still have a stuff on my weekly overview that I want to get done, um, which is like do create the outline for my, not my next YouTube video because I filmed that last night because I was just like bored, I guess and I did it at 9 p.m. last night. So I filmed that already, but I wanna, the one for March 3rd. So I wanna go ahead and get ready for the one for March 10th. So I wanna create that outline because I do wanna film that next week. And I'm gonna do that now. And I do all my outlines in, well, sometimes I write notes. So they could be a little bit mumble jumbled. So I'm just gonna open up my notes app and then I am going to, um, do that because that's not going to take me that long because like I said I have it in my notes so I'm going to do that real quick through a series I actually got this I'm not even going to act like I did this myself or figure this out myself because my, obviously you can see um if you're watching this video when it actually posts it I only have 66 subscribers so I clearly am still trying to find my um people the people that need to hear the message that and and, and want to not only hear it but apply it to their lives so I'm still trying to find that so I got this idea from Sean Cannell and the Think Media team. I actually really like them. Um, but yeah, so they were talking about understanding the goal of your video. So now before I even 
create the content or um, film the video I go through like a series of questions of understanding like exactly who this video is for so I can really truly talk and pinpoint and pinpoint um who I'm talking to who I can who's going to relate best to this video and um also the goal of this video and what problem the video solves and so they helped me understand that in their YouTube challenge that happened earlier this year. And so now I'm more focused and clear on exactly because I know it's so cliche to talk about target audience and nobody wants to talk about your target audience. But I really am, am truly understanding as a business owner, if you don't know your target audience, you are legit talking to no one no one so you have to have a target audience and regardless of everything that you do any books that you write any videos that you make anything that you do that you're trying to sell and reach the masses i guess um anything anything like that just a random amber alert that didn't even go off on my phone this is from yesterday my gosh, I'm trying to film a video here. So I don't even know where I was, but yeah, so I go through a series of steps because if you don't understand who you are, you, you can't talk to everyone. So you have to find out in each video, because each video I do, I'm not talking to necessarily a single woman or a woman that's just um, with a boyfriend or girlfriend. I could be talking directly to a wife. So this video that I'm doing an outline for now, I'm talking to future wives meaning you're engaged or you're looking to get married and then current wives and then also you know my goal is to help you understand your role to prevent uh, misunderstandings to prevent uh, miscommunication and frustration because a lot of marriages are failing because they don't understand their roles and although your role will look different amongst the two of you i just want to give you a general idea of what you need to be doing every wife needs to be doing regardless of your um, nationality your race it doesn't matter every wife should be going through these steps that I'm going to break down and so I did the YouTube title so one of his suggestions or two is to create your thumbnail before you film the video so I'm not sure how this is going to work uh I'm going to try it out because I haven't shot any pictures yet <laughs> um so we're going to try this out and see what happens I'm getting ready to ride out somewhere with my husband so most of everything that I do throughout the rest of the day will probably be filmed in the car with like a little explanation and I'm done the outline like I said I just really I don't write down the only thing that I write down verbatim what I'm going to say is my opening to like help you understand what the video is going to be about blase blase that's the only thing that I write down verbatim the rest are just like bullet points um you can't see um, bullet points of you know the direction that I want to go with the points that I'm trying to make so I'm gonna go put this on a charger my um uh, uncle passed away a week ago um he was just found dead and it was just his time and so I'm watching his wake online and I plan to attend the graveside funeral, which is in South Carolina. I live in Georgia, um, but he's from South Carolina. They live in Maryland, him and my uh, great aunt, which is my grandma's sister. So they were, um, he was my great uncle um, through marriage. But, you know, my family, we've never been like the through marriage type of people. Like when you come into our family, you are family, period. So he was just as important to me as my great aunt. 
which is my blood his wife is so i'm gonna i'm watching that online right now and i plan to attend the funeral in south carolina since i'm only four hours away and i'm so used to traveling that you know four hours is really really nothing so i'm watching this now i'm just gonna get ready um throw some pants on because my husband is gonna come back and get me and we're gonna just ride out so i'm going to mark off on my trello board that i completed the outline and hey i have a lot to finish up but that's okay so i really have to finish the chapter balance boundaries which i probably do when i'm riding out with my husband then i have to um film our podcast episode which i never did that day dating outside of your religion finish the ego class which should be done today and create social media for the month of march so we're doing good so let me just go ahead and get dressed and i'm gonna keep this funeral up and i'll see you guys all when something great and wonderful happens in business but this is what it's like working on a weekend this year now that i've set boundaries for myself <laughs> which i'm so happy about because lord knows i just was not nah I just wasn't gonna work out with what I was doing in my life. All right, guys. So I just got done watching my uncle's viewing online. So now I'm gonna finish up the ego masterclass outline, and I've actually been working through it and putting it in slides as I'm going, so I don't. Um, so I could just start recording as soon as I get done with the outline and I know you know the direction I want to go with things so I'm doing that that should take me about maybe two hours to finish everything and then I'm going to probably record it either tomorrow Sunday or later tonight I'm not sure about that yet but I'm going to finish this up and watch some Grey's Anatomy on Netflix and yeah, chill, I'm getting stuff done. Yeah, you, you think you got the best of me But just because I'm giving you my love for free Are things not for real? You've been telling everyone about us But you are not the only one I call for producing so I have my old handy dandy Mac and the phone is completely charged I brought my notebook and I am ready to get some stuff done while riding out hopefully I don't get a headache or anything like that but it should all be good to go I feel I like mean, that's something that we can film, you know, right. maybe like two, three minutes and then put that on the actual page. I think one of our episodes, if you still have the footage, we can actually make an episode out of our vacation. Yeah. I was thinking about putting the Grand Canyon trip on that page, but... We don't have a license for the music that I use, so that's why I just went ahead and uploaded it to um, that page. But what I'll do is I could just delete them off my page and then repost them that way, I guess. Like refurbish them or something. So, for those who don't know, my husband and I let it focus a little bit. Can you focus on me? So, my husband and I, we are working on our own YouTube channel, like a reality TV series. People always tell us that we need our own show because, like, we're just so lit and 
for us to be for him to be a minister for me to be a first lady like you wouldn't expect like we're just very very down to earth like we're not the stuck up people that you would imagine with him being a pastor and me being a first lady or whatever so we decided to open it up share on how we roll youtube channel which is available now there's nothing on there yet because we are you know still outlining like you just heard what we want our show to look like how we want it presented to people and all that good stuff so that's something that is something new that we're starting out obviously you know we do a podcast together but because the podcast is under the love inspiry uh, is a subsidiary of love inspiry we're gonna leave it on love inspiry's channel and just you know focus on our lives our whole lives you know right now my vlogs are really truly just about business when i'm vlogging it's all about business and um yeah my journey in business so that page how we roll is going to be about our journey in life together what do you think guys i'm sitting in the back because i needed more space to do my work as you can see so there's nothing fishy going on i was mad earlier but i'm over it now but that's not why i'm sitting in the back so yeah i think i think we should film our intro um get a couple of b-roll shots and all that good stuff and um once i feel like we have enough b-roll what is a b-roll <laughs> it's like footage of just like i want to insert it in to show people you know us having fun or like going to church or now we can't do that because church is canceled tomorrow but yeah. um just showing like inserting it into as we're talking and introducing ourselves you ever see that like uh, people yeah. flash yeah. you know what i'm talking about like people yeah. flash like we're talking right now and uh, like like say i'm recording us right now and we're just like having a conversation talking back and forth to one another but when we do our intro we're going to be introducing ourselves like hey i'm a i'm angie we like to have fun and then like i would insert this footage of us like talking and communicating in as like backup footage right so you said you get what i'm saying like yeah. that's what it is yeah. i feel like there was an easier way to explain this but you know me and do the roundabout we are going to finish talking about that. And like I said, you can go subscribe to that now so you can get ready. We will be shooting our intro soon. Just, um, you know, as soon as we get ourselves presentable and all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, so 